Okay, good morning. So, um, yeah, I decided I'm actually gonna do this before I go in for surgery. It's Surgery got pushed back till two, two this afternoon. And um, maybe I already told you that, but <clears throat> I just didn't think I would be, oh my goodness, what am I doing to my hair? Um, yeah, I just didn't want to, uh, I don't think I'm going to be feeling up to it after. So I thought, well, I would say good morning. <laughs> and, um, as I get ready to go. And, um, yeah, it's, it's, there's a lot of mixed emotions with all of this, you know. As I said yesterday, I'm, I'm excited about it in the sense that I'm getting rid of something, um, recognizing what brought me to this position in many respects, mentally, emotionally, environmentally, all of it. I mean, it's like peeking out there. Um, so the, yeah, that's exciting. And um, at the same time, it's the idea of actually losing a part of myself, right? That's a little um, hmm, nerve wracking. <laughs> anyway, um, this probably won't be that long. I wanted to say that I'm only allowed to drink, I think they told me eight ounces of um, clear liquids. Coffee was allowed. Just can't put cinnamon in my coffee, but I'm allowed eight ounces of liquids up until four hours before um, my surgery. So eight ounces isn't a lot, because I, like I like to be hydrated, and but I'm not gonna go without coffee, and then I, I just can't put cinnamon in it. Um, so this is my cup, the Happy Frog cup. Um, so I have a little bit left in here that I'm gonna be sipping on just because, I, like I said, I like my morning coffee. Um, but they made a mistake telling me I can only have eight ounces because like I'm like crazy about making sure that I don't go <laughs> over the eight ounces. I'm thinking, well, maybe just, well, I don't know. But this is clearly more than an eight ounce mug, so I did not fill it all the way up. I actually only put like, half of it. And it's interesting, I've been watching people, you know, there's always, because it's the, this part of the hemisphere, the northern hemisphere, it's every, it's cold weather, so everybody's like, live, loves, I don't know about you, but I love to hang on to a warm mug because it warms my hands in the morning. I think it's probably the reason why I like coffee, but, um, um, I don't collect mugs. I have to have, I mean, I do have other coffee mugs for people who come visit, but this is mine because it's so big. I like a big mug. And I look at some of these other ones and it's like, unless it's a soup bowl, I don't want it. I mean, I want, I want to be able to put liquid in it. I don't want to, don't want to do shots. I'm not into shots. I never have been into shots. Just give me a glass to wrap my hands around and let me have fun with it. <laughs> so yeah, I don't, I don't really collect mugs. I mean, if you guys know of anywhere I can find really decent sized mugs when I'm talking about like 14 16 ounce mugs then let me know I've seen some that actually look like um I've seen flower pots that look like large coffee pot and uh, coffee cups and um which is always fun I mean I always like envision like just picking one of those up and actually drinking out of it but um yeah so I am always open to finding new bugs but this one I don't know if you can see how thick that's a thick rim I mean it's a thick nice pottery and um, that's the happy frog on that side and that's him on that side so it's a nice mug I mean I really dig it it's just um there's not like a lot like them so who knew it was gonna be a show about a mug but clearly I'm nervous and um, good thing is is they're not going to be doing general anesthesia that's what the nurse told me but it's actually gonna be uh, sedation like an IV sedation kind of thing so I'm cool with that um, so yeah, other than that, I'm going to finish up this um, list on um, blood thinners. It's quite extensive, you know, if um, I'll make that available <clears throat> um, as a PDF. And um, it's extensive. Yeah, if any, and this isn't just for what, what I'm going through. This is for any kind of procedure that's going to involve um, bleeding, you know, so surgery, basically any kind of surgery. Uh, you'd be surprised. You would be very, very surprised, which just to give you an idea, um, Rose and Jasmine are on this list. Yeah. 
So anyway, I'm not going to bore you with a lot of information because I'm, other than, yeah, I, this is about me today in the sense that me needing to take care of me. And um, I just appreciate you being here. I'll be back tomorrow um, with uh, an update on how surgery went and how I'm feeling. And yeah, just to say hi and acknowledge you because I do appreciate you um, very much. So until then, cheers. Have a really beautiful day.